Hello and welcome to another episode of Coffee Fusion. This week we're going to look at how to pour a tulip. Hey Team Fusion, so last week we started the Latte Art 101 online course on the Coffee Fusion website and we started with the heart tutorial and so this week we're going to continue straight on with the tulip. So if you've been practicing your heart you should now have a good idea of how to pour that bulb style pattern and get that heart working in the cup. And the tulip is a similar style of pour but just a step up in difficulty. Let's take a look at how we pour it. So you start off exactly the same as you would any latte art and that is by setting the crema. And just as some revision, you do that by slowly pouring over the crema with your steamed milk. And so just as you would with the latte art heart, tilt your cup slightly and move your jug close to the crema and pour in your first bulb. The first difference here compared to the heart is you wanna push that bulb towards the back of the cup so that you have room to pour subsequent bulbs into the tulip. Now with your first bulb, it's very important that you push it into the center of the cup because all of your subsequent bulbs are gonna follow and push into that first bulb. So if that's not centered, you're gonna end up with a pattern that's pushed off one side or the other. So from here, we wanna just repeat that technique of pushing those bulbs in. And when we're pushing them in, we wanna make sure we push them into the center of the previous bulb. If we continue to do that, then the previous bulb each time will wrap around evenly and you'll end up with a nice symmetrical tulip. Now, obviously when you've poured a lot of tulips, it looks quite easy, but don't be too put off if your uh, first tulips are asymmetrical. It just takes a lot of practice and a lot of time learning how you can guide those bulbs into the uh, previous bulb, but keep practicing and you'll get it in no time. Thanks guys so much for watching. I'd love to see your tulip pours. So if you're uh, on Instagram, make sure you shout out at The Coffee Fusion um, if you're gonna pour one and then I'll be able to see it. Remember, if you learned something from this video, make sure you click that like button because that really helps me. And if this is your first Coffee Fusion video, make sure you click subscribe because there's gonna be more videos like this coming right up. Also guys, remember that on the Coffee Fusion website, which is coffeefusion.com.au, there's the online coffee school now where you can watch a few videos back to back all on the same topic. So if you wanna learn about coffee, that's a really good place for you to go. And remember guys, Coffee Fusion is my full-time job and my uh, career path from now on. I'm also roasting specialty coffee. So the best way to help out if you like these videos and you live within Australia is to buy some coffee from the roastery. Um, I'm roasting small batches, buying really good greens. So yeah, definitely check out the uh, roastery if you haven't already. Thanks guys, I'll see you next week for an episode on the Rosetta, but until then, keep frothing.